We have some junior, they're three-year students. They've been going to this school for three years. Um, they're, it's an introduction to abstract and impression style art, so this is a very new style to the, to the students. Uh, this one here is a lovely color. Let's see some figure, looks like he's sitting on a swing or sitting on some... Okay, so let's, let's just go through these. 来，我们看一下，这总共有三十张画，是，呃，是一个在校的应该大三的学生的艺术设计。他觉得这幅画看起来整整个像一个是一个风景画，像一个地图的样子，整个中间的一道像一个河流。颜色看着非常不错。This was done by two students. Uh, they were taking turns painting something they've never done before. Each one took a turn with a brush stroke, and the other one was reacting to what they were doing. Um, so this is sort of a, a double, dual artist getting together, and really lovely result for two students who. 实际上，这幅画是其实是两个学生共同创作的。他们。是是轮流着一人一笔去进行作画，最后合作完成的这这幅呃很不错的一幅一,一幅画作。Two trees. Okay, maybe I'll do the camera. Okay. And then you can tell me if uh, two trees. The next one. Vegetables. How do I say vegetables in Chinese? Shu tsai, yeah. Shu tsai. Shu tsai. Yeah, shu tsai. Shu tsai. Vegetables, very colorful. So the original paintings are 50 by 60 centimeters. These are just some small print copies, some small on paper color prints of the. 实际上，其实这每个学生他整个最后真实的画作应该大是三十到四十厘米、几十度的阴影那样那那那种大小的画框来画作，最后可能由于这个条件的因素，<笑>我们把把把把整个这个画缩缩小为二十到三十厘米。And the microphone's not here, it's here.、Oh. So, so you have to. 说这个这个这个。这个、这个、最后这个摄像头是在那的，所以我真是不好意思，所以不想录镜。A nice eagle design. 就是看着像像整个像一个鹰啊 ，It's a it's a kind of eagle shape. So each of these paintings begin with they use glue construction, you glue some gawking. So you can see the texture uh, when you view these paintings. Uh, something they all have in common. You can sort of see the texture, the gluing. Mostly red. There's a bird here. If you look really carefully, there is a nice little bird design. 如果看到的话，可以看到这下整个是一个像鸟的形状，这是鸟的。Beak, 鸟的鸟缘。Dancer looks like we have a. 就像这幅画是以一个跳舞者，一个舞者为主题的整个画作。舞者跳舞，跟 dancer。舞者。Here's a before and after picture of this dancer. The student, the artist, used a dark color. She wasn't happy with the dark. Color of the dancer, so she used some lighter colors to. 就是这个学生刚开始画的时候是以左边这个，呃呃为雏形的。他觉得，呃，最后可能在画的过程中觉得这个深色不太好看，所以又进行了一个改动，最后把整个她这个裙子变成了浅颜色的东西，浅颜色的。Lovely colors in this one. Very lovely colors. 这个颜色看上去其实很很生动，是活活泼这种感觉。So, nice, bright. The student 
having fun with some shapes here. Looks like we have like maybe a shark. 看上去这个整个是是像一个鲨鱼的形状吗？有鲨鱼。这是鲨鱼。鲨鱼。鲨鱼。这太难了。This was also done by two students taking turns. They were doing like a shared, shared painting. Yeah, 这幅画其实也是由两个学生共同创作的。Very lovely result there. I think they did a really wonderful, wonderful work. Here we can sort of see a, a face pattern, a face design. 其实我们这幅画应该从整体来看，可以看到一个面部的构造轮廓。I was suggesting to the students,、um, showing them one strategy is to use like a face design in their paintings. 所以他在呃，我在指导学生进行创作的时候，更鼓励去学生在整个画上用一种暗藏的手段去突出一种面部表情的构造。Some really nice use of the glue here. This student really did some nice、uh, gluing design. 这个学生真是在在创作的过程中充分利用了这个胶水的形状，来把它整个主题去突主题去凸显出来。We have the face pattern in the clouds. 可以看一下整个这一块，其实是一个整个的是一个是一个脸部的构造，两个眼睛、鼻子和嘴巴。And we have spray bottles, like the spray water bottles, everywhere in the classroom. So this student used the spray bottle. As, uh, 其实我们在在创在画画的过程中，教室里很好多这种这种这种。Lovely colors here. Very lovely. This one doesn't have glue. This is a painting without the glue. 啊，这幅画其实是在创作时候前期没有涂胶水。没有胶水。没有胶水。Beach scene, scenery, beach scenery. 这整个是一个海滩和大海的那种整个的景象。The pink, dirty sky. I really love the colors of the sky. And this one's maybe like my favorite one out of all of the paintings from this particular class. 他觉得这幅画应该是在所有这整个三十幅画中最满意的、最喜欢的一幅画作。My favorite. This one, a lovely water lily. Water lily. So how long has it been recording? Let's do. Let me check the time. Does it say on the bottom? Eight minutes. Eight minutes. About eight minutes. Okay. About eight minutes of recording. We have a nice water lily design. This one was popular. Most of the students chose this one as their class favorite. One of the class favorites. So many students in the class. 进行最后画作评选的时候，都把这幅画评选为他们最喜欢的一幅画作。呃、uh, ，these two paintings very impressive.、Uh, I keep telling the students to look, let the glue decide what they see in the painting. So,、uh, this student saw the shape of the bird head and and just allowed allowed the glue to. 所以这整个这这幅画在学生在创作过程中是完全依照了整个胶水的形状和构造，去去进行创作。整个的整个这个画的，它这个胶水的形状突出着整个这个鸟的形状，所以学生依照这个胶水的形状去进行创作，是完全按照胶水的意思。所以这应该是一幅很非常成功的画作。And this student did a lovely job finding the animal shapes. We got a crab. 呀，学生，这个学生看到了，也是根据这个胶水的形状，呃，最后看到了一个整个这个螃蟹，整个的这个这个形状，所以最后把它画成了一个螃蟹这种动物这种形状。螃蟹。螃蟹。这块。螃蟹。螃蟹。
So that's that's a bit of our look at the quick look at the little bit of color in the lobby here of the lovely lovely school library. Oh yeah, one yeah, student. She's should we interview her and see if she? Yeah. <laughs> it's a good idea. Really? Okay. Let's stop it.